Navora Blade Works. I'm going to try to do a video here on the Horribilis series of knives. And even after the, the grizzly bear, um, you've probably seen pictures on the website, but this is the sheath system. The one for the regular straight blade Horribilis has two vertical molly clips, so you can carry it vertically on a pack. And the other side is a center long mouse clips so that you can put uh, another modular pouch on the outside of your sheath. So if you put this on a modular belt, then you'd be able to carry um, maybe a flashlight or whatever you want to put on the outside of the sheath. Locking mechanism, uh, quick release pin goes through a hole in the skeletonized hilt. And then you can see there, that's skeletonized so that you can have a place to if you wanted to lash this to a pole and use it as a spear, you could. The uh, the blade geometry, you've got a bevel on the back with a nice sharp edge closer to the hilt. So if you needed to whittle with it, you can put it in a reverse grip and use that edge for whittling. Whereas your chopping blade or edge is going to be up here in the belly of the blade and then the, the point a 40, 40 degree included um, point so it's nice and strong at the tip and the false edge is just a smooth bevel so you can grab a hold of it with your hand and use it as a draw knife. The heavy duty model has a short mouse clip and a long mouse clip on one side with optional using two. The reason for doing this is so that if you do decide to put it on a regular belt you have less uh, range of travel so it won't slide up on your belt as much um, and then the long one you could swap that out if you want to but I think I use red light Loctite to get put those on and that would be reversible this one comes out a little differently because it has a belly on the blade very difficult to do this one hand so you see the little bit of a belly on the blade, and then different point geometry, more of a Skinner uh, wide bevel on the point. And uh, it's just a little bit more of a chopper. You can see the retention on the sheath uses the spacer up um, on the false edge to keep it in place. And then it just pops out the back. So for belt carry, this would be a pretty quick draw after you get the pin out. So that's the Horribilis and Horribilis Heavy Duty. I have two more of these in bronze and and with bronze with single tone um, flat dark earth tiger stripe. So kind of like this, but with only one extra color. And then I'm out of these regular ones. Um, but the next batch will probably be made out of 3V. So. If uh, you want one of those, let me know, and maybe when the cows come home, I can get, get them done. See you next time.